Good morning. Well, I'm going to do a little bit of this this morning, then I'm going to get the scaffold moved and do the other side of the turret pockets. Yeah, today's a good sunny day. Okie dokie. First things first. Okay, in theory, this should just slowly slide over this way. Okie dokie.
Right, so here's something I really need to try save. So this is the original plaster work and actually this ceiling is different from all the other ceilings. Don't know why that was, it could be because it's more modern or older. But either way, I want to try and keep a bit of it to take a moulding and then if I want to put it back in this room or another room later, I've got the original design. Taking it out may be tricky. Ah. Ah. Ain't happening. It's far too crumbly and brittle. Obviously this was the highest point, so I assume the heat's really affected the plaster here. What I can do is take some really good pictures of it all and save them and then, you know, go from there. See, a lot of this coving from this era was done the old way, so it was where you just put loads of plaster into the corners and you go over with a form and create the form of the coving and then these little bits here would have normally been stuck on afterwards and that's how they end up so perfectly spaced when you get to the corners because you can just adjust them all ever so slightly so that when the corners meet it all is nice modern version of this is pre-cast plaster not as good not as easy to meet in the middle but yeah difficult to take off but the ones that are still on there I can take mouldings of and use later yeah anyway Okay, well that's all the pockets cleared out. The problem is this side is very, very rooty. Loads of little roots coming from the balcony in each of the holes. And that's because of all the trees that are growing out there on the balcony. Their roots have worked their way in. Luckily they're only small, so what I think I'll do is I need to come up here and either blow torch them or poison them. Annoyingly, really, I need to take the trees off of the balcony as well. This is one of them jobs that's all rolling into another. This is a bit of them little turquoise triangles that are at the top of the chateau. I have no idea why they were put there, but yeah, that's what they're like. Little ceramic thingies. Uh... Let's just have a peek on the balcony and see what we're up against tree-wise before I go any further. Right.
So in terms of up here, cut two trees down, kill them, have a good burn out of all the pockets, make sure all the roots are dead. And then we're ready to fit the joists. And they should slot in pretty, I don't want to say it, they should slot in pretty easily. And on that note, just since it's about to rain, I'll see you tomorrow.